I'm so honored to be recognized in this way by Bates College, so thank you all of you. Uh, I must say that being here is bringing back lots of memories from my own undergraduate experience at a small liberal arts college. And I'd like to see a show of hands from the graduates. How many of you were caused to take a course in a subject that you would not have chosen to study otherwise? <laughs> <laughs> uh, as Trish said, I was an art major and I was caused to take a science distribution requirement uh, and it changed my life. And uh, uh, one of the main messages that I want to get across to you who have had a liberal arts education is don't be afraid to cross boundaries. Uh, I think a lot of the problems facing the world today are so complicated that it's going to take people who can talk across boundaries and work across boundaries to solve them. We need more than just scientists and economists. We need humanists as well to work together to solve these complicated problems. And you who have had a liberal arts education are probably better prepared than most people to be able to work in this new world and make it a better place. Uh, you're graduating, obviously, during challenging economic times, and you may not have your dream job right away, but that doesn't mean that life can't be interesting or rewarding. One thing I should mention uh, is that we carry with us our education that makes us see pieces of the world more deeply than other people. For example, we can look at these flowers, and they're pretty to everybody, but to me, they're really gorgeous because I understand the physics of how the water is transported through them. And those of you who are biochemistry majors probably think they're really cool because you understand photosynthesis. And those of you who've studied other fields can perceive pieces of the world around you with more depth and understanding and appreciation than the rest of us. So don't forget that. Um, you've learned how to learn here. And my challenge that I would like to give to you today is at the end of every day as you go forward from here, ask yourself, what did I learn today? And if you didn't perceive your world enough to learn anything new, then live tomorrow differently. Life may be hard, but don't let it be boring or, or superficial. <laughs>